Hey guys, and have you read by the title that we're going to be joined Jeff the Killer? So, um, this is what you'll turn out with. Yeah, I know it's pretty cool. And I'm only like a beginner, and I've been practicing a lot to draw these. Where to go? And there's my cousin Josh. So I mate. Yeah, and um, he's going to be like holding the camera so you can see the paper. Like it's going to be like that. So let me skip to when we got the camera set up. Um, we'll be back, I guess. So guys, um, I went a bit silent there for a moment. I didn't know I put it back on camera. So what you're going to need? Red felt tip, a rubber. Well, in case you like, if you're really good, you won't really want these bits on the back of a pencil. A normal pencil, a black pen so you can like go over it, and like a black felt tip. So, let's get started. So what you want to start off with is his hair. And his hair, I always used to like struggle with, but now I can do it really good. And I don't mean just like, oh, it's good hair. I mean that really good hair. And if you hear my cousin Josh laughing, you know who it is. So, yeah. You do like a little spike if it is. I'll hold it upside down like that. Like you want to do it like that. Then you want to go back from the. You want to go on the inside and do it like that. Then I'll flip it over again so you can see. So it'll be like that. And then you just do like a circle, like around the surface. You just do got. You can just do like a curve like that. So. If you know what I mean, you do a curve like that. And then his smile, you got to go one like that, and then one above it again. But the smile, what you have to do is, you got to put a line there and a line there, okay? And for his teeth, I'll do the bottom row first. You do like little things like that. And you do like you do four of them, then you do the same on top. You do four, and try and make it look like really symmetrical because then it looks really good. And his eyes, what you're gonna have to do with his eye, like one eye is really small, and one eye is like huge because um, he got when the story is like he gets battered by a bullet, he lights him on fire and pours bleach over him. And then he like burns off his eyelids, that's when he goes like a psycho. Okay, as you can see they're like a little bit bigger than each other. Then what you want to do, you want to do his pupils. Or you do like a little slope on the side of his eye. Then you colour that in with pencil. Um, what I don't get, he doesn't have a nose, which makes me laugh sometimes. Then you do a curve off like a little part of his hair. Then you go down, and then you go across a bit like that. And we get onto the other side of his body a bit later. But then what you're gonna do, you're gonna do his arm, which I'll just do. Okay. That's how you do his arm like that but it's not as good so you know what, I'll, I'll use the rubber for that I didn't do his arm that good just rub that part out redo that bit and I'm just gonna say sorry to Josh because he really wants to like help my videos become better so give like credit to him because he is a really good cousin and that my arms are aching <laughs> all right so you do his like knife like a little thing like that and you do like a spike like this then you do his fingers you do four fingers then like a thumb what's on the top like that and he's like holding it down by the way the camera is like different to where I'm facing so you see how his arm is on that side it's actually on the other side so that's how you do that arm and then you do a little slope up but just before you get there 
You want to go down again, and you want to go across. Then you want to make it like bubbly again. And then you do a slope so it looks like his hand is in his pocket. Like that. By the way, you don't have to do it exactly how I do. So look, he's like that with his hand in his pocket. It looks better if you like me because he, he don't look as actually. I'm going to make, rate, make his arm a bit more short to where it was. Yeah, his hoodie looks better like that now. So then you want to go from like... Anyway, you want to go like right, just a little gap of between his chin. Sorry, I couldn't get my words out there. And you do like that. And like on normal hoodies, you do like the little circle. And then on this side, you do like a little slope. And that's his, actually his hood. Uh, my Josh has just moving the camera a bit. Sorry, look. That's the hood, yeah, there. And there's like the things what are on normal hoodies. Um, this is like the last part. You go down to how long you want his feet to be. All right, I'll show you how what you do this bit. It's pretty easy. This bit is. All right, so you see how I've done his legs. This, yeah, we forgot the bits there. Oh yeah, I forgot. Oh, wait, what bits, Josh? The books on his eyes. Oh yeah. The, oh, thank you, Josh. Because he wears like makeup and that, he has like stuff leaking off his eyes. So look, that's like, just real quick for his eyes. Look, thanks for teaching me that, Josh. And if you want me to like a redo where I like improve it, ask me to do one of them because I'll do anything for you guys except for crazy stuff. Can I borrow your ball? Oh, yeah. that's just my cousin Ella. Like that. That's just my cousin Ella. Then you do like, look. I can see the camera, so I know what you can see. Look, then you do that, and I'll skip back to when I've coloured it in. Okay, be back in a minute, guys. All right, guys, and I've now coloured it in. Like you do his hair black, and you do black rings around his eyes. I've got to do some hair where it's like in his face a bit. I did like blood on his knife and like the black bit and like blood on his jumper but what I, thought, what I didn't want to do because I went it was like I couldn't be bothered but I might do if I ever do a redo you have to do his um, pants black so yeah bye guys I hope you enjoyed the Jeff the Killer tutorial come here Josh alright bye guys Alright, I'll see you on the next one. Um, leave in the comments what you want me to draw next because I think I can get used to this. Alright, bye.